Yeah, ironically, on the day that Lexar announces they're kicking the bucket, these came in. These, everybody keeps asking me, so I thought I'd leave them in the package for a second, make a video. If you have an XT2, at least in card slot number one, especially if you want to write raw files to card slot number one, and JPEG to slot two, which will give you slightly better buffer and a slightly uh, uh, deeper buffer on your uh, Fuji X-T2, use these. Uh, the prior ones to these used to be 280 megabit per second, which 300, these aren't really faster, not that I've noticed anyway, but anyway, those were replaced. And these are the new standard. Um, I think one of these are like 60 bucks a piece, I believe. But uh, anyway, this is it. These are the ones you wanna get if you have a, uh, a, a fast camera with SD cards. Um, I'm gonna even say Sony. Some Sony users actually watch my videos. I'm not a Sony shooter, but uh, these are the SD cards that you want. 300 megabit per second, UHS-2, SanDisk, SDHC cards, the Extreme Pro. Now, uh, the 95 megabit per seconds are okay for slot number two, and those are really cheap cards. I thought, what are they right now? They're I think they're like $16 for 32 gig cards on the 95 megabit per second. That's okay for slot number two. But anyway, for your XT2, snag these for slot number one. Okay? Okay.